r slash ask reddit by redmond ets what's a social thing or act that should stop being normalized and seen as a crime politicians investing in the stock market while simultaneously making decisions where our tax dollars go celebrities advertising medication commercials for medications at all sure have ads for the over-the-counter medications i guess but what you get prescribed by a doctor should not be influenced by an ad agency. Pranks against strangers. Kids beauty pageants. Back in the 90s one of my friends would get abused by a lot of guys in a beauty pageant. A lot of people knew, no one did anything. We complained, we tried to save her. Only to get pushed away by her own family. She was winning, it's not that bad, they said. She was only 9. A derailed her life at 12. She was only a shadow by 17. Paparazzi. Basically legal stalking and harassment. Driving like an asshole. Teen tried to cut me off at high speed, hit me head on, and now I'm paralyzed from the chest down. Being 18, they had no money to pay any damages and were old enough that they were no longer their parents' responsibility. My life is destroyed, and their only consequence was a sub $200 traffic ticket. For profit prisons, hospitals, and schools. Intentional misinformation, especially from media companies calling themselves news. Farmer advertising, marketing to the public. Duck, unaccountable money in politics. Corporations writing legislation in their industry. We pay lawmakers to write legislation, not corporations. Taxpayer dollars simply handed to profitable corporations in the form of subsidies. Corporations take billions and billions of our tax dollars in assistance and we're focused on far fewer assistance dollars given to individuals. Watching TikToks at the movie theater. Using your phone at all in a cinema. Recording homeless people when giving them money or food. Camps that parents send their kids to to try and change their sexual preference. Good news. Conversion therapy and conversion camps are already illegal in a lot of places and many more are trying to outlaw it. Sharing your child's video or picture on the internet. Especially in the context of family bloggers or family vloggers. Also, and this might sound controversial, showing you kid in your dating profile. Yeah, you might scare off the ones who won't date single moms. You'll also attract the sort who might be more interested in your child than you. That's all folks. Thank you for watching. If you like videos like this one, why not like and subscribe for more? Have a nice evening.